In this video, I'll demonstrate how to perform a face swap using Fucus, along with sharing some tricks to enhance the accuracy and realism of your swaps. Plus, stay tuned for valuable tips on how to make money using this technique. After extensive experimentation with Fucus, I've unlocked its full potential. Let's start. Open Fucus. First, let's configure everything correctly. Click on the Advanced tab and change the image number to 4. Performance doesn't necessarily need to be set to quality. I consider speed a better option in general because it yields nearly identical results but faster. Regarding the aspect ratio, feel free to choose whatever you prefer. I'm going to stick with the current aspect ratio. Additionally, there's a tab for styles. We can experiment with different combinations to achieve various outcomes. For now, I'll stick with the default settings and select the focus photograph style. Moving on to the Models tab, choose the Juggernaut XL model. It's the default option. In the Advanced tab, we won't need to make any changes at the moment. We can adjust them later on. Now that everything is configured correctly, let's begin with the first method for face swapping. First, check the input image, then navigate to the Image Prompt tab. Drop the image of the desired face onto the prompt, then click on Advanced. Within the Advanced settings, locate Face Swap and select it. I'll demonstrate how it appears with the default settings applied. Enter a prompt and click on Generate. Now let's evaluate the results. As you can observe, the woman in the image is enjoying a picnic as requested in the prompt, and it bears similarity to the provided photo. However, there's room for improvement. To enhance its likeness to the photo, we should increase the weight. Let's try a weight of 1.3 and click on Generate. Wow. The results have significantly improved, and the similarity to the provided photo has increased notably. Let's explore another option, adding a pose. To begin, navigate to the Describe tab. Copy the portion of the prompt that describes the woman and remove the remaining text. Next. Drag the image from which you want to extract the pose and click on Describe this image into prompt. Review the prompt, and if it doesn't align with the image, click the button again until you're satisfied. Then, head to the Image Prompt tab and edit the prompt to include the description of the woman, ensuring it corresponds to the first photo. Now, drag and drop the pose image, select Pyrocani, and generate the image. The initial result is satisfactory, but subsequent ones are not safe for work. This is because we didn't specify the type of clothing the woman should wear. Let's address this issue. To rectify this, instead of utilizing Pyrocani for the pose, we'll employ CPDS, which incorporates some stylistic elements. This produces a superior version. However, the program doesn't recognize the type of clothing she's wearing due to the darkness of the image. To address this, we can specify in the prompt, with armor. This ensures that the results will feature armor. To further enhance the results, we can repeat the process by dropping the same pose image and applying Pyrocani. Then, we should increase the stop at and wait attributes of the CPDS image. Click on Generate and await the results. As you can see, it has improved the quality of the background. However, it appears that the program doesn't recognize the elements as clouds. To address this, Let's specify dark clouds in the prompt and generate again. If you wish to further refine the face, you can utilize upscale variation. An important tip to make this feature work effectively is to enable the developer debug mode in the advanced tab. Then, in the control tab, select the mixing image prompt and vary upscale option. Next, Drag the image you prefer the most to the Upscale or Variation section and choose Very Subtle. Finally, click on Generate. As you can see, the results are significantly improved and of higher quality. Now I am going to show you how to do it faster and keeping the exact same background, but before continuing, please subscribe. Your support means a lot and allows me to create more content like this. Let's navigate to the Image Prompt tab and upload your image. Select Face Swap and increase the weight to 1.2. Next, head to the InPaint or OutPaint tab and drag your image into the designated area. 
Using the mouse, select the portion of the image you wish to modify, such as the face with the hair and neck, ensuring a seamless blend. Once you've completed this step, proceed to the Advanced tab. Enable the Developer Debug Mode, then navigate to the Control tab and select Mixing Image Prompt and In Paint. Paste your prompt, describing both images, and click on Generate. As you can see, the face appears natural and blends correctly with the body. This method provides the fastest and easiest way to achieve this effect. However, since only the face is being altered, the body will retain its original tone, which can seem odd. To rectify this, remove the image from the InPaint tab. Then, navigate to the Upscale or Variation tab. Uncheck Mixing Image Prompt and InPaint, and check Mixing Image Prompt and Vary Upscale. Next, drop the generated image and select Very Subtle, then click on Generate. Let's observe the results. As you can see, the face now aligns much better with the body. Let's compare the before and after images. The transformation is impressive. Don't leave yet, we are still missing the money-making tips. But before that, please take a moment to share in the comments section below which face swap option resonated with you the most and why. I'll make sure to respond to each and every comment. Now to generate income, consider offering freelance face swap services to create personalized content for individuals on their social media platforms. You can utilize platforms like Fiverr to advertise your services for free and begin earning passive income. Pricing for your services can vary, typically ranging from $5 to $25 per photo. And since there are no associated costs on your end, you can maximize your profits. An alternative option is to create an AI influencer, which is relatively simple and can potentially lead to substantial earnings. If you're interested in learning how to do this, I recommend watching this video or this video. Additionally, if you enjoy content like this, please leave a like and subscribe. Your support means a lot. Thank you for watching.